I'm sorry if I hurt your ears. But you do know it's a Kylie live, so it's gonna be noisy because it's celebration time. Yeah, yeah. How exciting! We can finally order from the occasions catalog. How long does it feel like that's been happening? One more time. Okay, I'll put them away now. I promise not to hurt your ears anymore. Oh, Jasper and Bella got in here. They heard the alarm bells and they're like, what's going on? Is mummy okay? <laughs> is everything all right in this damp room? <laughs> now, how is everyone? Please say hello when you jump in. How exciting is this time of the year? We all love freebies. I love freebies. They're the best. Hello, Faye. Good to see you. I've got some new products to show you today. Yes, we're going to be doing some creating. Last minute, I'm like, you know what? I'm going to whip up a card. Hi, Carolyn. Sherry. <laughs> I know, it's wake up time, it's like an alarm bell. <laughs> hey Megan, hey Bonnie, good to see you everyone. Yay Trisha! <laughs> Thank you all very much for being here, it is so exciting. I'm thrilled, yesterday was, pff, we had four new team members join the Crazy Crafters. Yay! <laughs> Oh, we're so excited and I know that there's going to be a lot more. I have set the goal of 70 for our entire team and for myself I'm hoping to get more than 20 new join uh, the Crazy Crafters team because it's such a good deal. Hopefully you saw my videos on YouTube that I did to show you how you can get $146 of free product. Yes, give us freebies. Yay, Patricia! Party time! <laughs> Good to see you. Hello, my friendly stalker from Switzerland. My flowers are still looking amazing. Thank you. They're so beautiful. So this is what we're using today. Dear Doily. As soon as I saw this stamp set, I was like, Oh, I have to have that one. It's mine. I'm getting it now. And with this, of course, is the beautiful, hi Anne, is the beautiful framelits that go with it. So there's these two pieces that we're going to use today. I'm going to show you something a bit fancy. And this side as well. I like putting mine on magnetic sheets. So we're going to have a fun time with that bundle. But also, we're going to be using another bundle today. And this bundle is gorgeous. Look at these, look at these. And these are page 27 of the new Occasions catalogue. If you haven't seen them, they come with uh, the Well Said Stamp Set. And these framelits, they're called Well Written, but it's a bundle. And you have a lot of words there. So, yes, it's very exciting. Hello, Marissa. Good to see you here. So, I'm going to surprise you today. Let's get creating. I know it's a bit of a shock, isn't it? We've got to jump right on in and get happening. I'm going to put my little face there in the right place. Because, you know, I can chat and craft at the same time. I know it's a surprise, but I can do it. Good morning, Wurgie. Good to see you. So, the colours I have used, of course, you could decide to use any colour that you like. But I have decided to do basic black, whisper white, and crushed curry. I haven't used crushed curry in a while, so I thought I'd pull that out and have some fun because it always looks so gorgeous next to the basic black. But of course, you can do this exact same card that I have no idea how it's going to look because it's still in my brain. I still haven't actually made it. <laughs> It was a very busy day yesterday, welcoming all the new team members. <laughs> Good evening from the UK. So we're going to have a bit of fun with this framelit here. I'm going to bring over my big shot because there's exciting things that happen with this die. And I just realized I probably should get my brush for 
any of the extra pieces. Now, someone did ask me about my trolley. I'm just going to bring it over. I don't think you can see it on the small... Oh, yes, you can. So, I've got one of these IKEA trolleys. And Bruno invented an idea. I think he might have seen it online somewhere. Where he turned the top table upside down. And that is where my Big Shot sits. So, a little suggestion for you if you have one of these trolleys it's very very handy i'm loving having it just sitting here always and then it takes up like it was taking up valuable pressure precious um land uh what do you call it land <laughs> property <laughs> on my table so it's really good to move it over here because now i have more space for my thinlets and chopping so yes that was a very it's a genius idea from bruno batucci's behalf now, I have swapped over my plates, so I have brand new plates on here. I always get sad when I use brand new plates. I'm like, <laughs> they're going to get cracked. But what I have to make sure is after I finish, I've got to make sure I put them underneath. That's the one thing that I keep forgetting to do because it does help stop them from bowling. Real estate. Thank you, Robin. I'm like, valuable land landscape. <laughs> you clearly can tell I haven't had my coffee yet. See, I need a coffee in the morning. So let's wind this through. Dun, 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 dun. Spotlight have them too. That's good. Hi, Carol King. Hi, Catherine. I'm just doing this a couple of times because I don't know if this cuts really well. It, it may need the precision plate. I probably should have started with that, but because of new plates, it might be okay. But something like this, what you can do is turn it over the other way and you can see by the cuts, you can sort of almost see like a little bit of the um, dye coming through and then you know, yep, it's cool. It's being cut. So this is going to create a lot of mess, which is annoying because I just vacuumed yesterday. So we'll try and contain it though by putting it directly on here. And what I find I can do to keep those little pieces at bay without landing on my floor is then to use my foam here and tip that in the bin. Or use the bin that's not full, because if I use the full one, then they will end up on the floor. Ta-da! They ended up in the bin! Yay! And then we'll do the same with this one. Now, what I love about this die, I don't know if you're noticing it already, but it doesn't cut it out fully unless you use the other piece. So Stampin' Up! are very clever and they've given us some options. We can cut it out or in my case, I want to leave it here. I want to create a pattern on my piece of crushed curry. So let's do the next piece. Put that over there. If I ask you where my Big Shot um, brush is, it's just behind the iPad. Because <laughs> in about four minutes, countdown, I'll be like, oh no, where did I put the brush? So I'm going to do three Fibonacci sequence. I'm going to do one big one there that becomes the star of the show. Good morning, Kathy. Yes, I figured you were talking about the trolley at Spotlight. Shirley, thank you. 45 degrees there today. What's that in Fahrenheit? Oh, what's this piece doing here? What's that in Fahrenheit? Someone needs to ask Siri. I don't have any spare technology. Oh, yes, I do. Hey, Google. What is 45 degrees in Fahrenheit? 45 degrees Celsius equal 113 degrees Fahrenheit. 113 degrees Fahrenheit. How good is that? I can just ask Google. <laughs> I forget I have a little Google home over there. <laughs> I'm going to have to utilise that more, especially when I'm doing my math. Hey, Google, what's one plus one? The answer is two. Thank you. So kind of you. That's going to come in very handy with my lives. How come I haven't done that? <laughs> Hubby was correct, was she? <laughs> too funny <laughs> how big is the diameter of the doily oh 
Hey Google, <laughs> what is the diameter of the Stampin' Up doily? Sorry, I'm not sure how to help with that. <laughs> so it's about eight centimeters, or yeah, a little bit over three inches, probably three and a quarter inches. There you go. Yes, we are definitely staying in the aircon today. I am not venturing out. Hello, Alison Okamitsu. How exciting that we had our first live in our January bonus event this morning. And Jackie Williams did so well. Oh my goodness, I love, <laughs> I love her card. Yes, we're doing well, Jenny. We're coping. We've got, we've got, um, air con. <laughs> I'm making you laugh and spill your coffee. <laughs> Well, you know, I don't know how to do one plus one. I've got to get Google to do that for me. And <laughs> my Google Home answered you too. <laughs> That's so funny, Leonie. Hey, Google, tell Leonie she's beautiful. Sorry, I don't know how to help with that yet. Oh, right, Google. I reckon Siri would be able to do that. Jesse and I have competitions of who's going to answer the question. So if Siri doesn't answer the question, then we ask Google. We're like, oh, well, competition's on. If you can't answer it, Siri, let's see if Google can. <laughs> Yay! I'm a bit cray-cray today. Can you tell? I haven't even had coffee yet and I'm cray-cray. I think I'm just, I'm on the celebration hype. I could not believe it. And... I had someone join yesterday who I've never met before and I still haven't been able to contact them because our reports with Stampin' Up are not updated. So I don't even have their phone number. I'm going to have to call Stampin' Up today and say, can I please get my, my new team member's phone number so I can ring them and say hello? Because I've never met them. They've never ordered from me. They've never been on a newsletter. Maybe there's a few of you that are stalking me here. Are there a few stalkers watching me now? If you're a stalker, just write stalker. If you've never commented on my page before, I want to know. I want to know my stalkers. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, look how pretty that looks. Now, while we're here, I was going to put this away, but I won't yet. Because there is another piece that I need to cut out. Which is using the little framelits, the little words. So I'm going to say, thank you. Thanks, friend. That's what I'm thinking of anyway. That's what's in my head. I'm thinking that'll look good. So what you need to do, I keep these spare. Oh, here they are in front of me. So I keep them in their packet. Hi, Louise. Hi, Rose. Oh, Rose is a stalker. Oh, I love a stalker. Thanks, Rose. Oh, Noreen's a stalker. <laughs> that is so funny. Thanks for coming out of the dark, stalkers. Lurkers. I love a bit of a stalker. Just don't come to my door. <laughs> then I'll be scared. <laughs> you used to be a stalker, Marisa. I'm so glad you've come out of the stalking phase. It's so much more fun to be part of it all. It's all just fun and games when you're commenting. Then I can say, hey, Marissa. <laughs> Whereas before, I couldn't even, I didn't even know you were there. It was like you didn't exist. We can't have that. We've got to, we've got to let you exist. You mean something in the world. You can pretend to be a stalker. All right, Tammy. Go, pretend. <laughs> stalker, stalker. <laughs> So what I'm going to do is just cut off what I need. So this bit here, you've got to be careful with this because this is actually, the, the line here is no sticky bit. Although it would still stick fine. You probably could use that. But let's use a piece that is going to give us enough adhesive. So I'll cut that off and then I just put that back in my little stash. Cut across there. So I'm giving it plenty of room. There is so much adhesive of this, like this multi-purpose sheets adhesive sheets there's so much of it that you don't have to stress about using a lot of it and it's really affordable so look how much i've got there still and i use it all the time so don't be afraid to use your multi-purpose adhesive sheets because i know for a while and the only reason why i'm saying it is because i was the same i'm sorry i'm just getting used 
rid of this alert. I need to use my other hand. <laughs> yeah, so I used to be the same. I'd be like, oh, I don't want to cut any. Or if it was a big sheet, I didn't want to use a big sheet. Hi, Jennifer Frost. Ah, you noticed my video in your feed. I know, isn't that exciting? My new cameras. So it's actually a switcher studio and I use my phone and my phone. Two phones. I've got my old phone that I normally would sell, but I'm like, no, I'll keep that for my videos. And then I have my iPad and my iPad controls what I would like on my screen. For instance, we'll just take this moment now, we'll just have a little intermission to have a look at this amazing deal here. Look at this. It's a carry bag, but I have a better one here actually that I put up. Bruno made me this graphic and I had to make sure I used it because it's so gorgeous. So I'm going to ooh, take that off, put that on and then add me. Hi! <laughs> Isn't it cool? Switcher Studio. So this here is our carry bags, our tote bag that you can get if you join. Isn't that exciting? So the tote bag is only if you pick option two. And if you're not sure how to join up, I'll be putting the videos up later. Nah, not clever. Technology is doing it for me. It's doing all the hard work for me, so it makes me look fancy. But really, I'm just Carla Batucci. <laughs> you like my infomercials? <laughs> we'll just take this time to go to our sponsors. <laughs> to our Stampin' Up! sponsors. So, all right, we're leaving that there. I was about to pull that back, but no, do not pull that off. And remember where you put it. In fact, it probably would be better. No, we don't want to do that. I've done that before. You have to make sure that the sticker is on the back because one time I'm like, I'll be really clever and I'll do it this way. But then the sticker's back to front, especially with words. So just know where you've placed it. Do it up in a corner somewhere. So you know exactly where it is. Yes, I have done all the mistakes. You learn from your mistakes. So don't worry if you do boo-boos. Boo-boos is how we learn. That's sounding good. Crunch. Oh, did it go through? Yes. So you can just test it before you remove it. Because if it's not sort of coming out in, in a certain area, you can just run it through again. But that's looking very happy. Oh, thanks. Thank you. Uh, so let's move our big shot back to his little place here on the trolley and we'll move that back there so I feel like I have freedom. Good morning, Suzanne. How are you today? You just missed my infomercial about my amazing tote bag that you can get if you join. Ha ha ha. I messaged Suzanne yesterday. I did. I gave her a proposition. I said, Suzanne, I'm telling you, this is the best deal. This is what you need to be doing. But you know what? As I said, you can do whatever you want to do. Because either way, I'm happy. I'm happy if you're happy. That's all that counts. Isn't that the truth? Because whether you're a customer, whether you're a team member, it's all happy. I just know how cool it is being a Stampin' Up! demonstrator. Look what I got in the mail yesterday. I don't even know if I'm meant to be showing the front cover, but I'm going to because this is part of our perks that you may not even know that we get. We get this magazine sent to us as demonstrators that's exclusive to us. And it's 31 pages jam-packed with ideas and the paper is so beautiful. And it is just gorgeous. The things in here, like, ooh, oh. You can't get your eyes on that, can you? Because you're not a demonstrator. Oh, get out of here. How did they do that? Oh, they've got instructions here. See, look at all the things you're missing out on. I'm just doing it for your best interests. I want you to get the best deal. <laughs> now, do we raise it? I think I'm going to raise. Oh, no, actually, I think I want it next to it because I've got a little thin millimetre layer. I did plan that. And I think I'm going to do it this way. I feel like it, it sits not. Yes. 
My eyes are happy now. My eyes are happy with that change. I know, it's really cool. And I'm telling you, that's just one of the, the few things that we get that you don't realise that we get. Some of us are heading off to New Zealand for an event, an onstage event in April. We get exclusive invites. We get to order a month earlier. In fact, if you join now, you get to order from the annual catalogue a month earlier. So you get to order in May instead of June. And you get 20% off all of your orders. And, you know, we all know we're going to place an order. That's the crazy thing. I'm like, we all know we're going to spend more money, so why not get 20% off? To me, it just makes absolute sense. I'm just adding a little bit more glue in here if you're wondering what I'm doing. I didn't want that sticking up too high. And same in this little corner over here. I probably could have used multi-purpose sheets on this as well, actually. It would have been good. There we go. And then I'm going to use my basic black. I just cut it in half, of course, to get my card front, the A4. Where's my burn folder? I'll get my nice one with my name on it. Look, someone gave me this at on stage. See, look what happens. You go to these events, people give you gifts. I know my crazy crafters team, we usually have about, how many go to the on-stage events? Probably around 40 or 50 in each event. And so we all um, find out who's going and we give each other gifts. You don't have to, but that's something that we all do because we're a cool team and we love each other because we're on the Facebook group together. Oh, oh my goodness, I just died. This is so beautiful. And I haven't even put this on yet. Oh, I just died inside. It's so beautiful. <laughs> so nice. But I'm going to raise that. Yeah, totes. But, you know, I like that, Suzanne. You know why, you know why I'm number one in Australia at the moment? Because my team is awesome. That's the only reason why I'm number one. Because I have a rockin' team. And they work very hard and we have a lot of fun. And they all know I keep it real. I'll give them all the support they possibly can get. But they also know that they're completely independent. I'm their number one cheerleader and their peer. I'm not their boss, just their peer. And they know that. They know that I've always got their back. And I'm always there for them if they want to do something, if they have a goal that they want to do. But I never, ever, ever force them to do anything they don't want to do. Unless I think they should. Then I kick them up the bum. <laughs> but I know the ones to do that too. <laughs> if I see someone being a little bit dramatic, hey, none of that. This behavior doesn't happen in the crazy crafters. Oh, boom. <laughs> well, I love my team. My team, honestly, our team, if we didn't have them, we wouldn't have this job. Team, team is number one. And as much as I love all you beautiful customers, you're number two. I'm sorry. But team is like, they're just amazing. I have to look after them because they have signed on the dotted line <laughs> and they have a lot of potential ahead of them it's a little bit more work when you join up in the sense that you need to learn more and that's what I love about it I love teaching teaching is my thing where are we going to put this thanks I want it to really pop out but not So what we might do, actually, I'll sit that there for a moment because I'm, I'm considering another option, although I do like that black. So I want to stamp on some Whisper White. I know I've got a scrap. Oh, actually, no. I'm going to do basic black. And I told you I'm totally winging it. Let's just make something up here. And if you don't know what winging it is, it means just... Um, Coming up with something on the spot. Does that sound good? <laughs> Thanks, Jennifer. 
<laughs> Suzanne's laughing. <laughs> yeah, I like these colours. These are one of my favourite, favourite colours, these ones. So I'm using the, in case you're wondering what this sentiment is that I'm about to stamp, I'm using it from the Well Said Stamp Set. And I'm going to use friend because we're saying thanks, friend. So you can have all sorts. Even in the um, framelits, it's got the ampersand as well and an exclamation mark, which I love. I might, I should even use the exclamation mark because I'm always using ex exclamation marks on everything. I just get a little bit excited about everything. Ah, oh, hi, Randy. Yes, I'm mixing things up all over the place at the moment. But I do feel that this is the new home. This is the new time. There we go. I like this 10 o'clock start. It's good. It gets me out of bed, gets everything happening, gets it all started, gets me creating. Yeah. So I'm happy. And Patricia, my stalker friend from Switzerland, said she's happy at this time. So if she's happy, I'm happy. <laughs> I've got to look after my stalkers. Hi, Carol. Oh, I'm so glad you want this set. So don't worry that it's a bit crooked because we're just going to cut it out pretty rustically. We're not going to be too fast. It's the new thing to even try and go crooked if you can, <laughs> which I find a little bit difficult. I'm like, oh, oh I want to go straight. But what you can do is you can go straight so we'll just cut it out first and then we'll have a play of this little piece. So, can I hear Bruno Batucci? Hi! Are you joining us? I just thought I'd pop in and say oh, hello. Oh, we'd love that. Did you see my infomercial? No. I used your graphic. Which graphic? Your Unreal graphic. The tote bag, option oh, two graphic. Cool. I went like this and said, we're just going to take a moment of your time here to show you this graphic. And Suzanne, I keep telling her she needs to join. Suzanne. Ellis. Yes. Yes. <laughs> In fact, yesterday, who was I speaking to yesterday? And then they placed an order and Bruno's like, why didn't they join? Think, Seriously. Was it a $400 order or something? Seriously, if your order goes over $169, you're crazy not to join. But, you know, we're happy to take the... We'll take you twenty percent. Did you see the cards I made last night? I know, pretty amazing. He was crafting last night. I could hear him. Came to bed very late. Did you see that thing there? Ooh, you're gonna see some good things from Bruno. And I don't, like, even though that didn't come out properly, sorry for interrupting everyone. So rude. Even though that didn't come out properly, I think it's perfect. Yes, I do too. But you know what's rude is they don't know what you're talking about. <gasps> don't show them yet. Okay, I'll just do a flip. <laughs> can I just do a flip? Oh my goodness, I love this. You can oh, do a flip. Wow. I don't know where the camera is. Where can I look? What camera? Like, what? what's yeah, showing? But you can see here. Oh, We're in the little that's corner. That's preview. Yeah. Oh, that's sorry, fine. sorry. Thank you. Thank you, Bruno. Okay, I'm going to I left the I left the infomercial on a bit I'm gonna long. I'm going to quickly show you something. Oh, that was quickly. Really? <laughs> what stamp set is it? It's um it's Beach Happy. Beach Happy. And also you need to say hello to Anne. Hi Anne. Deaf Anne, you can't just say hello. Oh. Yeah, Bruno will say hello. I have to learn this. N E. So do it again. A. A. N. N. Bruno's left handed, N so he uses a different. E. E. Okay. A. N. 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 N e. e. Okay. I think I've got it now. I think so. Until next time. They'll be like, oh, what was it again? A okay, bye. N N E. Yes. Yes. Bye. Bye. See you. Thanks for popping in. Hi, Helen. Is there any more stalkers out there watching and not commenting? I'm like, which one do I do first? 
<laughs> which one am I going to gauge? Yeah. Oh, I think I want this one down first because then I'm going to put this slightly on top. So do you like how I did it really wonky on purpose? Some of you who have OCD may not be able to handle this, but this is what all the young kids are doing. <laughs> so what I might have to do, because I really want that to sit there, but I may not be able to. That's okay. What I will do next time, in order to do that next time, I would need to cut out a number of these framelits. Like if I did about four of them, and then I could have them all sitting on top of each other and raised. You know what I haven't used for a while, and I think I'll use it on this card, is my Wick of Stella. I haven't used that for a long time. Let's have a bit of Wick of Stella. Because... What have I got here? Because I love having a bit of just subtle... Subtle bling. I think that's the one we need. Which is the wink of Stella that's still current? I have to push it because I know that there's probably nothing in there. Oops. Look at how long it's been. I'm like undoing it. Now it doesn't matter with the wink of Stella if you get it somewhere else that you don't want it. Because it's just so pretty. We'll see if you can see it. Oh my goodness, I love this stuff. And I should use it more often. Who does Wink of Stella on everything? Ah, oh, Randy loves her Wink of Stella. Yay! I'm really happy with that. So we're going to do the inside and we're going to do the envelope too. We need to do those two things. I'm very happy with how my he my brain <laughs> did this. <laughs> it came out the way my brain thought about it, which is probably a first. Now, if we do, I think we'll do a basic black. But maybe, actually, maybe I can do both. So, memento and crush curry. And then we're going to use, whoops, what just fell there? Oh, some drops. We're going to use, ooh, I know, we'll do that one and that one. I'll do two little ones in the crushed curry so that it um, offsets it with some colour. And this block should be good. Yep, that looks fine. <clears throat> so what we'll do, this is the insert here. Move the rubbish out of the way. Chuck that on the floor. Kidding. <laughs> you put in another order. Oh, yes. Yes, we all love celebration, Jenny. We're all broke at the moment. Everyone's eating baked beans on toast. <laughs> I had a really nice new dish last night that I made, if I do say so myself. But no, both Bruno and I really enjoyed it. It was a recipe that we found on Pinterest, of course. And it was a cabbage stir fry. How beautiful is that? So just use beef and cabbage and zucchini, capsicum, bit of um, sesame oil, some garlic and ginger. It was really good. We've got some leftovers for lunch today, which is always very handy. <clears throat> I like having a bit of leftovers. Not more than one day leftovers though. I get sick of it. I'm like, ugh, I'm so over it. I've eaten eaten it like twice in a row. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, that's good, Tracy. Pleasure. So I think that's all happy. You can always stamp off. Oh, that's sweet. And that, my friends, is our card. Look at this. I feel very organized today. I feel like I haven't. Oh no. <clears throat> I spoke too soon. I knew there was somewhere else I needed to stamp. Let's do here. It's like, oh, it can't be this easy. I haven't forgotten anything. Oh, 
yay or probably could be inked up a bit more but that's okay we'll forgive it I love having it all matchy matchy it's so pretty look at that how happy would you be to get that you'd be like oh my goodness this is like a momentous occasion there's like stamping on the envelope stamping on the inside it all just matches so there you go that is hey doily what do we think i'm very very happy yes capsicums and peppers oh arancini balls i love them yes oh sharon you're gonna pm the address that's nice i'm very sorry about that bonnie <laughs> Can you tell I'm really sorry? <laughs> it's called enabling. Because I reckon it's one of those sets that people go, oh, I don't know if I'll use that. So I thought, mm, I'm going to do that, that one today. One of the girls in my team talked about Hey Doily in our team meeting yesterday on Facebook. And I said, oh, that's totally what I'm going to use tomorrow. Hey, Rick Atkins. It's all happening here. I love it. There we go. Look at that. We're all done. Thank you all so much for joining me today. So if I do this, I have to go boom. And then I'll go like this. And that can be my photo. No, do this side. <laughs> ah, love it. Chop it. So what else is news? Oh, that's so nice, Patricia. I'm so glad you like it. Thank you. And Marissa would love getting a card like that. That's nice. <laughs> do you like my my freeze frame, do you, Suzanne? <laughs> oh, I'm so happy I've convinced you. Yay! My job here is done. Yes. No, I really, really love the thinlets in this. I think that it's such a cool idea. But even that beautiful stamp, like look how detailed that is. It's almost got like a vintage look to it. I can see it um, being done on crumb cake. Um, that'll probably be my next card. Do crumb cake and then do some sponging with some early espresso and um, yeah, do do some sponging over the top of the embossing. It'd be so beautiful because it really does have that sort of vintage accent to it, which is um, really pretty. Yes, I know. Too quick, huh? Well, in actual fact, I haven't finished. I'm still going, but I just thought I'd mix things up and create straight away for my YouTubers because I know that they like things like this. Come on. I haven't been that quick today, though. <laughs> but, um, yes, that's so true, Trisha. Simple stamping. That's very true. Oh, a $2,000 bill. <laughs> wow, well, Randy. <laughs> We're sad for you. Hi, Pavana. Do I say namaste? <laughs> You're just about to go to bed. <laughs> so, yes, so it's very, very exciting times here in Australia with Stampin' Up! And around the world, everywhere around the world, we're celebrating Celebration. If you have never heard of Celebration before, it is the best time to shop with Stampin' Up! Because every $90 you spend here in Australia, you get a free item from a special exclusive range. And you cannot buy any of those items from that catalog. So this is the little catalog here that we have. And all of these items in here can be earned. So there's a $90 bracket and then there's a $180 bracket. And I actually do want to show you something very quickly because a few of my customers asked me this question and I'm sure it's going to come up in other countries as well uh, I just need to open up I'll just put my screen on here open open says me I don't know why it doesn't want to open but anyway oh there we go so I'll just add you to this screen here so I can show you this. So what happened was when you go shopping with me, so say you're at my craftykylie.com, which is my website, and on that page you will see 
the shop or join, this is the much better option. You get a lot more for your money. But if you decide to shop, you click on the shop now button. And what I've noticed has been happening with some of my customers is they're, say we'll just put in, they really wanted to have $270 worth of products so that they could get a level one and a level two, okay? And what seems to be happening, we'll just put a big shot in there because, you know, we know that that's cost effective. <laughs> it's almost at the 100 and, oh no, we need 270, so let's do two. Whoa, low inventory. Okay, so that should give us what we need to see. So we'll go to the shopping bag. So at this stage here, oh no, actually we need to take off one because it, it's a bit confusing, this one. But anyway, this one will still show you. So what it's saying here is it's saying you qualify for one or more free celebration products. So you have three level one rewards or one level two reward. Now, some of my girls read that and they're like, but I want one level three and one level two. So please just disregard that because you still can get, it's not or a level two. You can get one level one and a level two. It's not or. It's like, and slash or, <laughs> if you know what I mean. So when you click on it, just push through and then you can choose a level one. So we'll choose one of these beautiful items. Look at these freebies. You've seen this beautiful kit here that I did. <clears throat> this beautiful paper. That was the paper that I used for our cards that went out with the catalog. That's them there. How pretty are they? So that's using the botanical, um, oh no, that's a different one. And oh yeah, that one's another one with the beautiful paper. That one's not just black and white. How pretty is that? So that's that paper that you can earn free if you spend $90. And there's also, what else did I have in here? Oh yes, these ones here. So there's these celebration kits here as well that I made up. So I did um, the full pack, which I think is eight in that, that kit, and it comes with an envelope as well. <clears throat> it has a beautiful vintage look to it, and it's very, very simple. So this is a perfect one to do um, with your maybe your daughter or something like that, and she wants something crafty, but she might be a little bit young. This is good for sort of first crafters or for crafters who are in a hurry, and that's me. <laughs> I'm like, quick! quick I did a cart in a hurry and this was perfect because we had quite a lot of these on hand we could send them to the team and send them to customers so they as you see there's a lot of beautiful ones there so let's choose all oh, this beautiful foil that is a standout that foil so we'll add that to our bag for free right and then we view our shopping bag again so we've added our level one that's gone in then we'll click again and we'll choose our level two because we, we know that we can get that. So these are the two that you can get for level two. A lot of people want this because there's a stamp set in the occasions catalog that goes with this framelit. So if you know that you're going to get that stamp set, you're definitely going to need the framelits. So let's go for the framelits and add that to our bag. And then when we view our shopping bag, you can see here it's perfectly fine. And it said now it's got you've got zero. If we try and do it again, <clears throat> so if we try and add another level two, what will happen? No, there's no button. See? So it will tell you when you can or can't add something in. So just keep pushing through. Well, let us add another one. No, you need to spend another $90, which is not true. We'll spend $90, but you have... Oh, we've got rewards too. Did you know that that's where your rewards sit? So you know you can spend rewards. Do not use the host code if you have rewards. So I hope that helps and I hope you can see that clearly because, um, yeah, I was really sad for one of my customers because she actually placed two orders and then she missed out on really good rewards. So I was a bit sad for her. I was like, oh. So I'm going to ring Stampin' Up! today and fix all that for her because... Um, <laughs> you love my laugh my laugh is so obvious it's like a mile away <laughs> yes and the tea framelits are carrying over that's a good point Catherine thank you for raising that 
So yes, I hope that helps because I know a lot of my, and I probably will do another little video just as a, a tip. Um, and I just hope that Stampin' Up! puts an end slash or just to sort of make it less um, confusing for everyone. So there you go. So have a wonderful week. I can't believe the weeks have flown by again. Um, we will be celebrating a lot of exciting things that we'll be creating today. I know I've got a lot of creative ideas. I think I'll be doing my vintage doily. And tonight we have the tutorial blog hop. Did I have my tutorial screenshot here somewhere? Um, we're all going to be hopping together the, the tutorial bundle design team <clears throat> and highlighting all of our work so that you'll be like, yes, I know I'm going to get a really good tutorial if I order from these designers. So I have a screenshot here for you. I think that's the right one. Yes, I'm excited. So I'll just bring that over. So this is the tutorial bundle um, samples or little sneak peeks for this month. If you wanted to get this tutorial bundle, demonstrators are welcome to purchase it. It's $20 Australian and you get 12 tutorials with instructions in both metric and imperial. So this is January's one. So don't miss out because it's got a lot of celebration and occasions catalog ideas, which is going to be perfect for workshops, launch parties, any ideas that you need. Just make sure that if you use it for an event that you just give us credit, whoever you've used. You say, this is a Kylie Batucci card. Because, you know, we love you talking about us at parties. <laughs> then they can follow us. Yay! <laughs> oh, so good, Woji. Oh, he's on the other side. Hi, hubby! <laughs> so that's our tutorial sneak peek. And as one of my valued crazy crafters, they all get the tutorial bundle for free because they're my team members and I love them. And all of my customers get one for free when they order. So there's a lot of offers, but I must say the joining's looking very tempting. Remember, you get all these cool perks that you probably don't even know about. There's a lot of exciting things that happen as a demonstrator. So if you have any questions whatsoever about joining, please let me know. No problem, Shelly. I'm just about to say goodbye. <laughs> You're here to say goodbye. Now, is there any more lurkers? Because I might have to draw. I'm going to do a draw later. I'm going to do a giveaway. Who would who would like to receive this card? Dun, 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 dun. Put a comment and say, me! And if you can, you can share it too. Because I'd like to send that to someone. I'll write in it too. And say, love, Kylie and Bruno. I know, I'm a bit crazy today. <laughs> Me, 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 me. Everyone right. Even little stalkers in the background. You're still there, Carol. <laughs> I want to see how many lurkers and stalkers there are. Oh, Jewel. Hi, that's a new name I haven't seen. Oh, thank you, Jewel. What a beautiful name. Sharon, me, me, me. <laughs> Marissa, yay! I'm so glad you're not a little stalker anymore. I'm glad you comment now. Yay! Oh, thanks, Catherine. Thanks, Shirley. I would love it. <laughs> Patricia, me! <laughs> thanks, Nikki. And I think I'll try a few other colours too. What other colours do you think would be nice? I think Bermuda Bay would be lovely. Even some pinks, even though I'm not a pink girl. I think it would look gorgeous. There's so many colours you could use with this. Yay! Raising both hands. <laughs> you could even do strips if you want to do strips. Glue them down and then do your cutting, which would be really cool and fun. Different colours. Yay! I love seeing all your comments. Thank you all so much. And if you're watching the replay, say replay. I'll have one for the replay peeps. Yeah. No problems, Wendy. I would love to see you replay. Say replay. <laughs> Pumpkin pie. There you go. Very nice. Highland Heather. Oh, good idea, Jewel. Even gorgeous grape. I love gorgeous grape. Oh, a few of you said Highland Heather. All right, I might have to try a Highland Heather one. Crumb cake and vanilla. Bravo, Catherine. 
burn. I love it. I could do some sponging along the edges. Very nice. I like that. Oh, thank you, Patricia. That's very sweet of you. But thank you all so much for your support. Bruno and I appreciate it so much. We're really, really excited about Celebration in the next three months. Um, it's super exciting for our business. And we're just so happy that all the hard work that we're doing is paying off. Um, it might seem like things just happen, but we work really hard. So it's really nice to see that the results are coming from that hard work. So thank you for your support and thank you for everyone um, helping the team with the team as well. The team's amazing. My beautiful customers. I'm just so happy and um, really humbled too that you've chosen us. So thank you. Oh, Bermuda Bay and Melon Mambo. Oh, I love it. Yep, you could do a different background. That's a really nice idea to put a different color in the back. We could even do gorgeous grape with a bit of Highland Heather in the back. Oh, look at all of you. I'm so excited with all your ideas. Bermuda Bay and Lemon Lime Twist. Even Lemon Lime Twist with the black. How hot would that look? Oh, I can't wait. Please tag me if you do the same design with a different color that you love. Please tag me and show me because I'd love to see it. I love seeing people case my work. Um, and I love seeing... Um, people being inspired too. So thank you so much. Yay! Have a wonderful week, everyone. Oh, silver foil, grapefruit grove foil. <laughs> and we'll see you soon. Thank you for being here. Bye. See you, everyone.